guys it's sunday and it's the day that i reset and think about the week ahead it's almost oops it's almost midday and i've got a lot to do so i'm going to do like my meal prep for the week five or six days my self-care and today will be a very simple facial which i'll show you guys so in fact i've got too much to do i've just potted some bananas they're just the right consistency or the right ripeness to either do banana pancakes but i think i'll make a, a banana bread so it might be a quiet vlog because it's a lot to do and i might not really want to talk too much all right tada So it's no secret that lately I have been struggling to get into a routine to kickstart um, eating healthier. So um, this is the first step. I've just sliced some sweet potatoes so that they don't go off because we bought quite a few of them. And I'm spicing salmon very lightly just with some white pepper, maggi and salt and I'll package that. And that will be my meal for a week and a half. I'll just remove each package from the freezer and cook. Um, I don't know about you, but for me, I don't really like that smell of raw chicken. So I always use lemons to wash them first. And then I prepare a base um, because I like my chicken to have enough gravy and enough sauce. So I spice it as needed. I mix some tomatoes, garlic, onions, ginger, mix it together with some um, oxo cubes and salt. And I just rub that around the chicken and I stuff in the stomach, I stuff um, some butter as well as onions just to give it that extra taste and sink you can add chilies as needed i don't really cook with chilies because of the kids As you'll probably tell the kids are part of our lives on a sunday i try to get them into activities that will help us bond and keep them busy because for me Sundays are family days, the days you spend with the family together, especially on holidays. So I'm just baking um, a banana bread. It's one of my best recipes yet. It always works every time. If you want to see the recipe, let me know. This was just um, a getting it all done vlog. It was not a recipe, but I know that you might want to see it. So just let me know in the comments in the comment section. With my chicken in the oven and my cake about to go in, I just thought it was time to tidy up. I did a deep clean and some washing. By the way, we are going away, so I have a lot of washing to do and prep. So um, it's just time to tidy up. When I was growing up, we sat down on the table together and had a meal most days or at least most 
afternoons or most weekends. So because of how life is here in Europe with the kids, Tristan doesn't live at home. The other kids have programs, football. We decided this summer that every Sunday we'll sit down together and have a Sunday meal. So this was, um, I just thought I'll show you guys what our Sunday routine is and just incorporate this aspect because it does bring the family together. It gives them that sense of, of being family oriented, having values and just spending quality time with the kids where we can catch up about our week and it's just great. If you don't do this, try to create some time. I know that it's hard, but it's quite rewarding as well. At the risk of blowing my own trumpet, look at how fluffy this banana bread is. It definitely tasted delicious. Again, if you want the recipe, let me know. So we're going to have this while we go up and watch the Man City match. The season is back. I have my weekly schedule planner. Coming week is even more important to plan because we're going away on holiday so i need to be really thorough on my planning usually sunday evening or morning depending on how busy i am objectives for the week got personal things like we're doing well we're mortgaging finances and i'm somebody who keeps very close i keep a very close eye on that so i'll be putting all my to-do items and deadlines on a planner and for youtube as well i'm beginning to plan youtube better because before I'll just shoot ad hoc. Now I actually plan in advance, which means I'm taking YouTube more serious. This is a typical holiday Sunday reset. If it was um, during the school term, it will be very different. The only person we're worrying about is Tristan because it's football season starts soon. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys soon. Although I use a lot of manufactured products, normal high street brands for my face, I always like to incorporate a homemade facial, which is my kind of self-care. On a Sunday, I have different. I have some yogurt, some with, um, I use things like honey, all sorts. This time it was bentonite clay and rose water. And um, I can give you the exact measurements if you want to know. What it does is it removes all toxins and declogs the pores. So it's almost the end of the day. I've had a mad but a very productive day. So I'm just about to take a, a shower. I don't think I have time for a bath. I'll take a shower, but I have to do my weekly facial routine first before I take a shower. I'll let you sit on my face for 15 minutes, take a shower, and I can relax in front of the TV with a cup of tea. After my shower, I just rinse my face off and look at how it looks, the glow. Honestly, it speaks for itself and I'll just put my normal cream, which is vitamin C at night. And I've applied all my hyaluronic acid and vitamin C serum. So um, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog today and um, I'll see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye bye.